Kicking off another work week. Hey, everybody, I'm Jason Laird with the Montana Ag Network. Here's a look at your agricultural weather forecast. This week, not a bad one to get out in the field if you have anything to do. Uh, maybe get into the first cut of hay, uh, hopefully start baling as well once things kind of dry out for us. Here's how the whole week is going to play out. We've still got an area of low pressure that's going to continue tracking through the state. Uh, Tuesday, finally making its way out of the area by Wednesday, allowing for some high pressure to build in. That's going to take temperatures up a couple of notches back into the mid 80s or so. Can't rule out a few afternoons showers and thunderstorms even Thursday and Friday this next week. But for the most part, high pressure is going to dominate our forecast with just the slight chance of a few afternoon showers and again, thunderstorms making their way through. However, winds are going to be the big story likely Thursday and Friday with those winds kicking up. The fire danger is going to ramp up Thursday and Friday as well. Moderate to high really going to see low humidity levels with the warmer temperatures and then some windy conditions on top of that likely going to dry out vegetation very quickly. And to give you an idea of where we're sitting, this was uh, the end of uh, June was our last report when it comes to crop moisture. Severely dry in south central Montana and a little bit dry in eastern Montana. The rest of the state, nothing reading in right now. So to kind of give you an idea how things are sh uh, trending this week, looking at a few showers Monday here through the afternoon and evening. Much warmer, though, by the middle of this week. And winds are going to really start to increase by Thursday and Friday. With that, so does the fire danger. So be a little bit extra careful. Have a great work week.